Oh, They're man. your fresh TV sport. I am not well known within the non-league scene. Those of people I know can leave a club and five managers will call them, but I'm not known like that. My current gaffer where I am says some questionable stuff in the change room. A lot of it is race related. Apart from me, I assume he's saying nobody apart from me wants to call it out. But if I end up leaving, I'll end up with no club and I don't have the catalogue to just go somewhere else. Do I address it or leave it? That is a techie one, you know. interesting isn't it because as someone and obviously we don't know the age of the person that sent it in it but as someone that works with young people I think for me it's about owning who they are do you know what I mean and and actually addressing these things because I think if we shy away from having these conversations and we don't encourage young people for example to be who they can be for me man's not really addressing anything if that makes sense it's like right is your football career more important than who's your identity is that makes sense. So, yeah, for me, it is it is important. So it's a hard one still. No, but I don't. For me, no, it's not. Hard yeah, one. for you, that's got a dream. He's like, you know, I know what's right and wrong, but should I just suppress this till I'm in a better position and rare? It's a techie one still. I would say personally, start looking for a next club. I don't have a resume. Da, da, da. There's internet. There's all kind of things in it. Talk to other people at next clubs. Try and line up a next club, next couple clubs. Then, when you have done that, tell you, then you could tell the manager to suck his mum and just do your job. Protect me, yourself I first. I don't think it's even about having that tension for, for me, but it's about what you represent and who you are as a person. Are you going to stand by representing an organisation that you know doesn't have your best interests at heart? Yeah, you if you're, you're trying to further yeah. yourself, yeah. you might hold that L and smart. say, you have, you have to balance, you have to balance things up, innit? But no one ain't mentioned there about Ra speaking to the manager, ain't it? Mm. Okay, if, if someone says something to you that you think, raw, sh- that one's a bit mad. I feel like speaking to the manager, I feel like that's, not, man- that's no. not helping still. But already, that's causing tension already. It's not now. tension, but the man that's even going to say that in the first place, you know what he's on, innit? Bro, man. Like, that there's a level. Sometimes someone might just be ignorant. But you speak something. to the manager, you know possibly. You speak, you speak to the manager, but you, you, you don't go direct. So, what you do is you, 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 you when you go to the manager, yeah, you want to go to the manager with enough clout backing and support behind you where. That manager has almost like he has no choice but to hear you out and give you a, your fair mm. dues. If you just go to the manager, that manager can he, now he's he's got the um, the most room to maneuver at the bargaining table, so to speak. Mm. So this is why I said seek out first in this current climate. It's not hard as well. You seek out the right advice, the right the right people to to back you type of thing. Then, once you've got that support and that backing, then you go to the manager or you go above him to the club mm-hmm. and say, look, I don't feel like I'm being fairly treated fairly here. I am guarantee you, that club will not want that mud to stick mm-hmm. on their name when it comes Come, to You've seen it on club. Twitter, bro. Yeah. You've seen these clubs where, where the, the manager or the chairman or whatever, there's a, there, he says something racist or there's a scandal. Man put it on Twitter, it gets traction. And then... Because he obviously hasn't... Like you said, no one wants that on their reputation. Because if you was a baller where enough clubs are on you, you got enough clout to go direct and say, yo, I don't feel like you're treating me fairly. And if that's the case, I'm trying to snap you up. But he obviously hasn't got that clout as a player. So you seek that that backing and support now from like so-called representatives of, do you know what I mean, that look like you kind of thing within the game. And then you approach either the club or the manager with that. 